Hey, hey, wives. Listen, Coach T here with you on today. I wanted to just drop by real fast on my lunch and um, just share with you why I am a believer in wives going through a hardship in a marriage. Why it's so important for them to have someone walk with them on that journey okay so i had a session this morning i do sessions sometimes for some of my vip clients um i do sessions like at 6 a.m in the morning and um i had a session this morning with a young lady um and after speaking with her it just really just really really helped me to you know help me really really to you know push why it's so important for wives to have somebody to walk with them on this journey because you go through so many ups and downs and curveballs on this journey because so many different things are coming up because you get hit with so many different things because the lord is trying to teach you something it's important that you have somebody walking with you okay too many people too many people throw in the tower too early just before god is getting ready to do something too many people throw in the towel so early and God is like, but I was just right here going to give you a breakthrough, right? And this is why it's so important for wives to make a decision to invest in themselves. Me as a wife coach, one of the things I am forever grateful for with my mentor is she was nothing else. She was a, uh, a, a motivator, a pusher. Like she pushed me to not give up. She pushed me not to throw in a towel. She pushed me to keep going. And that is just something that I really, really push in my sessions. Like, I'm not going to just let you just walk out of your marriage covenant without a fight. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just, that's just who I am. First of all, I'm too passionate about what I do. Second of all, I am just a believer. If God has spoke to you and told you to stay or told you to do something, you better hang on to that because it's a reason, right? And so you need somebody. You need somebody to push you on this journey. You need somebody to help you to keep going. And this is why having somebody to walk with you is important. Just like when you go into the gym and you have that, you know, you have that trainer who's telling you to keep going, you know, work out, push, do this, do this, give me, you know, one more, give me two more, give me three more or whatever. You need that same type of push when you are walking this faith journey out, believing God for your marriage. To me, why I think that this marriage uh, journey when going through this type of, you know, going through this type of journey is about the restoration of their marriage. But really... The biggest push in all of this, it is about the restoration of that wife because God knows what he needs from that wife. God already has a set day, time, and plan for your husband. God already knows what he's going to do. God already knows how he's going to change his heart. God already knows what has to happen in him for him to do what he's doing. But if he's telling you, wife, to stand, to stay, to push through, to believe me, to trust me, to focus on yourself, Focus on yourself and take your take your mind off of your husband. Focus on yourself and take your mind off of what, what's going on with your husband and your marriage. Listen, wife, I'm telling you, it's a reason for that. It's a reason for that. Too many wives are trying to get the free stuff. But I want to just go back to like if you had a personal trainer, a personal trainer is not free. You need to invest in it. If you invest in yourself, if you believe that God has told you to be in this place, make a decision to invest in yourself, all right? So I want to just come on real fast and just encourage you to sign up for your wife consultation today sign up and start doing your work sign up and start doing your part so god can do his part if he has promised you restoration if he has promised you that your husband's going to be delivered if he has promised salvation for your husband if he has promised restoration for your family if he has told you that hey your husband's gonna get together he's gonna come to consensus but i need you to get to this place believe him take god at his word and believe him just simply believe that he can do don't let and i always want to emphasize this somebody come in between you and your husband don't let a person come and just take your husband away from you without a fight god is faithful wise god is faithful and so i want to encourage you sign up today www.marriagechronicles.tanika.com blessings